In this demo, I'm going to be taking on the role as a customer support manager. I'm going to be leveraging the power of Tableau Next and Agent Force to take action from my dashboard. I can see here I've got information about my customer support cases. I've got some key metrics along the top of my dashboard around the number of open tickets, the days to close, hours to first response, and customer satisfaction. I've also got some information around the number of tickets open for each advisor, which accounts have the most tickets open, and how long each individual ticket has been open for. But I really want to find out a little bit more about my top and bottom performing advisors before I do anything next to this dashboard. And I can't get that straight away, so I'm going to turn to Agent Force and the Concierge skill to interrogate this a little more. So I'm going to pop open Agent Force and say, Hi, could you please tell me about the top and bottom performing advisors? So I've sent that question off, and it's going to have a think about it. I've asked for top and bottom performing advisors, but I haven't given it the information around what I mean by performance. Do I measure performance by the days to close? Do I measure performance by the hours to first response? Do I measure performance by customer satisfaction? And that's what it's come back and asked. So I'm gonna say, use the CSAT score, one of the prompted responses. And now it's gonna ask how many I want in the top and bottom. So I'm gonna say top three and bottom three. So it's, it's asking for the context around my question. And that's how it should really operate. We don't want it taking guesses. So now it's got that information, it's gonna go and interrogate this semantic data model that sits behind the dashboard, which leverages information from Service Cloud around accounts, cases, and users. And once I've got the information back from Agent Force, which I can see here, I've got my top performing advisors and my bottom performing advisors, I can start to dig into this a bit more. So I can see from my bottom performing advisors that Mel has a CSAT score of 1.7, which is really not great. And I can see here that Mel also has quite a lot of tickets open, one of which is in this severe category. So let's have a look at that. And we can see that this ticket has been open for over 80 days and it's related to a customer account that's locked. So I wanna dig into this a bit more. So I've reached out to Mel on Slack and I've said, hi Mel, I see you've got a ticket open with Bright Content. It's been open for over 80 days. Can you give me an update? And she's come back and she said she's reached out to IT and they're going to unlock the account in the next 24 hours, which is good. It's not great. The ticket's been open for a long time. But I now want to update the customer on this. I want them to, I want them to know that the ticket is getting open, the, the account's being unlocked in the next 24 hours. So I'm going to turn back to Agent Force to do this. So I'm going to say, Hi, could you update a case for me, please? And so now I'm not making use of the concierge skill in Tableau Next, but I'm making use of a service cloud agent. So it's gonna ask for some, again, clarifying information. So I'm gonna give it the case ID, and I'm gonna give it the comment that I'd like it to add. So I'm gonna say the case ID is, the comment is IT, are unlocking the account in the next 24 hours. So I'm gonna fire that off to my service cloud agent and it's gonna take a look at the case ID and it's gonna add a comment to the case straight from Agent Force. This is great, I haven't had to do anything myself. This is all through natural language. And to validate that, I'm gonna have a look at this case that Mel has open. So if we filter our dashboard again, I can open up this case ID I can open the record and we can see that straight from my dashboard, I've added a comment to the ticket, the customer is updated, and we can now all get on with our days, all through the power of Agent Force and Tableau Next.